Hey guys, Uncommon Ramen here. Uh, today for TCG Tuesday, I was able to get a box of MetaZoo. MetaZoo Kickstarter first edition. Um, I won a raffle at my local uh, game shop, and so I ended up winning this, which is super cool. So we're going to jump right into this and uh, open up all the packs. I usually take the shrink wrap off. My friend insisted that I leave the shrink wrap on because it makes it look more official, even though it has a nice little seal here. Um, so we're going to just have to do it on camera. Oh, yeah. There we go. So this is the Kickstarter uh, first edition one. So this is before the reprint. Um, these boxes are actually very rare, very hard to find. Um, and more importantly, uh, there's some print errors in here. So hopefully we see some of those. One of those was Tripadero, which I believe only comes in the foil version, or it's very difficult to find in non-foil, if I remember correctly. Um, and then there is the, what they call the Obnoxious 9, which was the same case where it only came in foil. I think maybe Trip Darrow was part of the Obnoxious 9. I don't remember. Um, uh, Ghost Train is one of those Obnoxious 9, uh, but I can't remember exactly all of them, so we're just gonna have to go into it when we go. So. Eee, open, wow. That is quite the seal, guys. You did a good job on that. For those of you who don't know, MetaZoo Cryptid Nation is a new trading card game that cropped up on Kickstarter and just went wild. Um, they became extremely popular uh, on their retail release. And um, yeah, it, it became very difficult to find these. This, is, this should be 36 packs, if I remember correctly. So we're going to try and jump through these as quickly as we can, but you know how it is. Um, MetaZoo currently, and I, I'm on their Discord, so I'm, I'm actually a member of their Discord, so I've seen a lot of their new announcements, and they just recently got um, partnered up with, uh, for, for distribution, they partnered up with Channel Fireball, and they also partnered up with uh, Rudy uh, from Alpha Investments. So it, it's becoming extremely popular, and that those are great um uh, moves right there for them. So let's take a look at what we get in this box. Um, most importantly for me, it's going to be auras because I haven't gotten, they haven't gotten brilliant aura in retail yet and I need aura. So, all right. River Dinos, Rumped Fusil, Sam's Four Leaf Clover, Shadow People, Scatter Shot, Balancing Beam, Shock Aura. The rare for this is Holy Gem. Very nice. This is the Reverse Hollow. I believe this would be the Reverse Hollow. So it's very pretty. And we got Forest Aura. So very cool. Da -da. What do you guys think of MetaZoo? Are you a fan? Are you uh, upset by the lack of uh logistics as far as how popular it was going to be um we will not see this little kickstarter symbol in the reprints so if you did not get any of these boxes you will not see that on your uh on your cards anymore which means that these ones are going to go up in value so we got ourselves a frost or i mean a snowing so this is actually a terra and not a an aura and our rare in here is Mothman, Reverse Hollow, which is actually a pretty cool pull, not going to lie. With Chibi Mothman, you could make a really nice dark deck with this, which I kind of want to do. That'd be really cool. The uh, foil slot in here, you're guaranteed a foil in all of these, um, but the foil slot will take up the rare slot, so if you end up getting a foil common, you are stuck with a foil common invisibility black cat and our terra page is going to be an ocean followed by our rare which is forest god's amber another mana rock or in this case aura rock 
I'm actually down for those. I think that if you are running, it, do, it doesn't matter what uh, what element you're running. These things are they they only take up two two spots because you can only have two of them, and they're just really really good for the uh, early game or a generation or even late game. Really, they're just good. Got ourselves haste, pyrokinetic blast, dragon's breath, invisibility, shock aura, and our terra page here is desert. Followed by Hodag. This is one that I haven't gotten before. This one's a reverse hollow. Hodag. This might be... Is this one of the obnoxious? Let me know if this is one of the obnoxious. This guy's got regen. Hodag. That guy right there. Do, do, do. Have you guys been enjoying this game? Anybody played it recently? Uh, there's a lot of people in the Discord channel that are playing uh, pretty much every day. And there's a lot of uh, tournaments going on. Why is there an uncommon in here? That's weird. Is that just a print error? That might be a print error. Uh, we have Exploding Mine. Hoop Snake. Hugging Molly. It's got to be a print error because... The uncommons are right there. And then we have our black hole shard, which is the uh, cosmic um, aura rock. So, and it's hollow. That's actually a really pretty card. Black hole shard, very cool. And our terror page farm. Yeah, I built, oh, you guys already saw, if you were watching this before, my previous video for MetaZoo, not the last video, because I did magic last video, um, I did a Dingbell deck, and I'm doing some fine-tuning on that. Um, I can't wait to get the Brilliant Aura pack so I can start brewing other fun decks like the Chibi Mothman Mothman Dark deck, uh, just because it's really good. Uh, so Chibi Mothman, White Thang, Giant Salamander, Pyrokinetic Blast, and Field Monster, Invisibility, Retribution, our forest terra not a lot of aura just a bunch of terra and another holy gem reverse so we got two of the reverse hollow holy gems very cool honestly the reverse hollow looks really great kind of gives it that shine that you would expect it to have i think the blue ox um is it babe the blue ox um is part of the obnoxious nine. I know that Sam <clears throat> is part of the obnoxious nine. Um, I, I'm sure I could look it up and just tell you guys. In fact, I think that's what we're going to do. Oh, look, light aura. It's upside down. That's weird. Well, here, I'm going to pull that off so that. There we go. Light aura. Woo. Boom. Growth. Very cool. So really quickly, I am going to go ahead and look that up. Okay, so as it turns out, this guy right here that I just opened is part of the Obnoxious Nine. Um, we have the death spell that I can't read from here. Um, it's it's a black card. If I, sh if I find it, I'll show you. Um, Growth, Uncle Sam, Chessie, Ghost Train, Silver Bullet... Um, I believe Power Up Red, Sam, and a Fire Spell that I can't read from here. Um, but this is part of the Obnoxious Nine growth. Um, so it's just, it, it, for whatever reason, it does not have a reverse hollow, if that's, if I, if I'm remembering that correctly. Um, so I didn't know that, actually. In my first box, I actually did pull the Death Spell. I also pulled Growth. Uh, and Chessy and Sam, so I ended up pulling four of the Obnoxious Nine in my in my first box, but um, that's neither here nor there. Right next up, Moon Eyed People, Lightning Bolt, Haste, Giant Salamander, Funeral, Funeral Mountain Terror Shot, Hoop Snake. Stone Skin, and Forced God's Amber. I'm actually really happy about pulling this. I know that I just pulled one, um, but I didn't have any in 
the beginning of this uh, in, in my last box so now I have two of them and that makes it just that much easier to make a uh, forced related deck and then I have raining the Terra card all right Let's keep going. So Babe the Blue Ox is not actually part of the Obnoxious Nine. It was Uncle Sam. I don't know why I got them mixed up. They're both completely different from each other. Paralyze, Matlock, Moon-Eyed People, Transfiguration, Black Cat, Chibiquetza. What a cutie. Followed by Bunny Man. So this is what I'm talking about. So that is a common but it is a reverse foil and it is going to take up the rare slots. There is no rare in this card or in this uh, particular booster pack. And then we have our ground Terra. Notice though, so this is, this is what we've gotten so far. A ton of Terra, but only two aura. So that's just, that's why they needed to do the brilliant aura pack because it just, you don't get, very many aura in this um and even by standards of land if you're talking about magic the gathering they don't give you enough in a booster you get 36 total lands well i guess you could you could actually build off of it because they only have five land types i think that's the that's where the difference is okay we got cactus cat earthquake again i think that's a printer exploding mine because uh, earthquake should be common fireball ice path invisibility lightning in a bottle and our forest, followed by ooh Fresno Nightcrawlers. Fresno Nightcrawlers is one that I don't have, so there you go. Very cool. This one you can't wear pants. Uh, cannot be contracted if you are wearing pants. So you either got to wear shorts, a skirt, a kilt, you name it. You just can't wear pants. And is it any good? Let's see. 40 HP. Uh, it's got spirit. So I believe it can't be attacked. It's got fleet, so it can attack. It, it comes in awakened. Nighttime modifier. 50 damage when Fresno Night Crawlers enters the arena. You may reveal any number of non cosmic pages from your chapter and then shuffle them into your spell book. You may bookmark an equal number of pages from the top of your spell. That's yeah, not bad. Not bad at all. Actually, it's really good. So it might be worth just jumping into a pair of shorts or something. It does say pants specifically, so I think you can get away with just shorts. All right. Sam's Rabbit Foot, Sewer Alligator, Snow Snake, Snow, Snow Wasset. Power Up Blue. Power Up Green. Are we going to get Power Up Red? That would be cool. Photon beam. No, we got giant salamander in a in a reverse foil. Not bad. Can replace my uh, non foils from the uh, from the fire deck. And then we got daytime. So again, I've gotten two aura so far and a ton of Terra. So not only are they competing with a ton more. Uh, you know, land types, uh, they're also throwing in that slot a ton of different Terra, too, so there's just no way. You'd have to open a ridiculous amount of boxes in order to, um, in order to ensure you had enough Terra to build a deck, or you would just have to buy the pre-constructed decks, but even then, there's still several types that you would not be able to, you'd have to splash, you just wouldn't be able to do it any other way. Wapaloozy, Four Leaf Clover, Telekinesis, The Pass Trap, Pass Trap, Dragon's Breath, Kentucky Hellhound, Spookster, Ooh, Mermaid Scales, very nice, another uh, Aura Rock. I will take Aura Rocks for days, honestly. Especially ones I don't have, I didn't have Mermaid Scales, so. And then Cosmic Aura, yeah! The other thing about the, um, the uh, Aura deck is that um, I believe they either all have alternate art or they have a mixture of alternate arts in there and some of the aura pages if I'm correct um, will come foil so that's pretty cool grounding uh, 
haste, health potion, hide behind, hoop snake, hug and molly, another bunny man, foil, and then ocean. Next up, it'd be kind of nice to get this guy. Um, originally, I was like in love with fire. I was going to build a fire deck. Um, now, I'm not so much. The electric cards are just so good. Lightning, I should say. That it just, you almost have to build that. I want to build dark still. Um, retribution. We have light aura. Yay, more aura. Eternal Snowflake. Again, another Aura Rock. This one's heavy with Aura Rocks. And again, I'll take it. Um, that should be my second Eternal Snowflake. Not in here, but uh, in total. Hodag. Do, 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 do. All right, Earthquake. See, this Earthquake is common. So, it has to be a print error, which makes no sense. Water Gun, Antidote, Bat Squatch, Morpheus. I definitely don't have that. Well, now I do. <laughs> Power Up Blue, Power Up Green, Dark Aura. Very nice. I don't think I've ever gotten a Dark Aura. Boom! Beast of Busco. Beast of Busco. Busco, Busco, Busco. You let me know how to pronounce that, YouTube. You tell me, because I have no idea. Some of these guys, um, I would assume is phonetical, and some of these I'm just like, I don't know. I'm just going to pronounce it the way I think it's meant to be said, because I have no idea. Space Penguins, Killer Clown, Bat Squatch, Water Gun, Chibi Quetz, Funeral Mountain Terra Shot. Photon beam followed by pl a pla- is it called Plaza? Plaza bird. The thing that I was saying I wanted. Very nice. I'm super excited. Even though I'm probably not going to play fire right now. <clears throat> Despite being in a desert. Uh, or very close to deserts. Snowing is our Terra. I don't know why I wanted the Plaza so bad, to be honest with you. I just, uh, maybe there's that's the collector in me. But that means I still need Uncle Sam and Babe the Blue Ox and, let's see, uh, Ghost Train, Silver Bullet, and Power Up Red. Uh, there's still a lot that I need. Gigi Bird, Ghost Deer, Giant Salamander, Grounding, Stone Skin, Spookster, Squonk. This guy's one of my favorites. I can't, I'm going to do a video. On that guy because he's just so funny and our foil is space penguins and we got a city oh i live in a city so i don't need that uh, terra all right next up snow was it telekinesis frozen people Earthquake, again, this one's common. So I have two uncommon and two common. Uh, Enfield Beast. Fire Trap. Fog of War. Meteor Shower. Followed by... What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Boom! Uh, YouTube already knows how I feel about the Slide Rock Bolter. Uh, you know, it's... It is... As playable as, as people allow it to be. But I still stand by the fact. I, I should do a video with a survival kit, which is just going to be ridiculous. Bring a potted plant with you. Bring a, you know, uh, sack of rocks with you. So on and so forth. A water bottle. Can't forget a water bottle. Uh, River Dinos. Rump Diffusal. Sam's Four Leaf Clover. Shadow People. Lightning in a Bottle. Luck Potion, Menehune, followed by Forced God's Amber. Oh, that's number three. I got three of these in one box. This one's Reverse Hollow. I have two Reverse Hollows. That's very cool. Followed by a Forced Amber. Or Forced Amber. Forced Aura. 
Forced God's Amber. I think I got three lightning glasses in the first uh, box too. It's just some of these you get like none and then others you'll stack up heavily on them. Matlocks, Moon-Eyed People, Old Green Eyes, Paralyzed, Rock Rain, Salem's Witches, Scattershot, Jersey Devil. This is going to be the next video, I think. I think I'm going to do the next video on Jersey Devil. Because I think it's hilarious. And I just can't wait to uh, go into my reasonings behind that desert. Which I also don't need, because I live so close to them. Yeah, Jersey Devil is a ridiculous card. Is he any good? He actually is decent, to be honest with you. He's got flying, he's got uh, scare. I think it's scare or fright or something like that. Uh, he's alright. He's not bad. GG Bird, Ghost Deer, Exploding Mine, Fireball, Invisibility, Kentucky Hellhound, Lightning in a Bottle, Hug and Molly. Oh man, I have so many of these in foil. Ah, uh, that's, that's a letdown. That's a letdown, guys. I'm really sorry. Lake. I also live pretty close to a lake, so... Don't need that. If you live... Uh, well, I guess a lot of places in America are close to lakes. All right. Sliver Cat. Space Penguins. The Skeleton's Lantern. That's neat. Wapaloozy, Crossroads, Dragon's Breath, Enfield Monster, and then we have City for our Terra slot. Sure, what do we have behind it? It's uncommon. It's the Salem's Witches. Boop. Do, 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 do. All right. Exploding Mine, GG Bird, Fireball, Ghost Deer, Invisibility, Kentucky Hellhound, Lightning in a Bottle, followed by Flatwoods Monster. Boom. There's a lot of fans of this guy. Very interesting card. Fire, Flame Aura. Yay. I shouldn't be so excited about Aura cards, but you know how it goes. You know how it goes. I think, you know, if you think about it too, from the point of view of Pokemon, even on Pokemon's side, when it comes to energy, there was still less energy types than there are um, aura types, I think. I'm almost positive, because I think, what is it, 13 aura types? You know, I could be wrong, but pretty sure it's pretty close. <laughs> Uh, Anti-Magic Spell, White Fang, Hide Behind, Power Up Green, Balancing Beam, uh, Unending Fire Crystal. Now, I actually pulled a bunch of these in the uh, first box, but that's still that's still solid. I love the way it looks. The crystals just look really good. And an island. I can't wait till they do uh, international, but most importantly, just doing like the uh, international... Uh, cryptids and stuff you know every culture has their own like version of it i suppose um so we got light beam lightning lightning bolt matlocks moon-eyed people cross rose dragon's breath enfield monster and sam sinclair there you go guys that is one of the obnoxious nine so i got two out of here not bad that's my second sam sinclair in fact so that's Pretty cool. Maybe it's maybe the world's telling me I should do holy, but I don't. You know, Sam Sinclair. I didn't think he was that powerful, but I, you know, I could be wrong. It is the first set. They are just kind of feeling out things. So, all right, two obnoxious nine. Joint snake. Killer Clown, sorry that didn't focus well. Necromancy, Poison Arrow, Menahune, Miracle Touch, Morpheus, City as our Terra. So behind that we've got Earth's Core. I don't have any of those either. So again, I'm totally welcome to the uh, 
a box full of crystals and tell me it's not holy cow so we got that 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 those that that holy cow this is all from one box i didn't come anywhere near that in my first box that was that's crazy i i still have more packs to open too jeez uh if you do, oh, also, if you want more information, um, some of you, I, I know a, a few of you that watch this are, are uh, actually on the um, Discord, but if you want more information, you should definitely um, join the Discord. I had to find a link online, but if you Google it, you can find the uh, link to their, their Discord. And honestly, there's a ton of really helpful people. We got Tizharuk, tiz Tizharuk, very cool. Yeah, there's a lot of really helpful people there, Spiritora. Um, they just have a ton of information and there's a lot of people who post a lot of videos and stuff like that. So there's, a, there's a lot of information going around there, not to mention the, um, uh, creators of this game, um, are, are heavily active in those, in the forum or not in the forums, but in the, uh, in the channels. And, um, they, they really do listen to their fan base. It's, it's very true. It's super opposite of places like Wizards of the Coast and Konami that just absolutely ignore their fan base. So it's, it's a breath of fresh air, not to mention that they're, they're out there for the player. Um, so they, they try to make these, um, products accessible and they're also trying not to like gouge up the prices and stuff like that. So it's just, a, it's a breath of fresh air for TCGs, honestly. Book of Shadows, Hug and Molly. Rock Rain, Earth Aura. I think it's my first Earth Aura in general. Death Beam. This is uh this is what I was talking about. The Death Spell from uh, the Obnoxious Nine. So that is number three for us. Death Beam. Very cool. Only comes in the full art. I mean the full foil. So what is that? That's three. Uh, growth. And Mr. Sam Sinclair. So those are our three obnoxious nine. I'm trying to see if I can get this to focus on just this for a bit so that we can get this as the uh, thumbnail. So yeah. Obnoxious nine, guys. And they call it obnoxious just because they, they are super rare to pull. Um, not because they're the most powerful cards in the set. Not like the uh, Power Nine and Magic. So, like, two of my earthquakes have come uncommon. All the rest of them have come common, so I don't know what, what that's about. Water gun, antidote. You can tell me below if you have a better understanding of what just happened. <laughs> Thorned Whip, Desert as our Terra. Boom. Eternal Snowflake. I'll take it. I'll take it. So this is a... This box has just been uh, lots of gems. Just lots of gems. And... and I, I welcome it. I welcome it. I definitely think I got more um, Obnoxious Nine in the first box, but again, uh, I haven't finished opening the packs here, so we'll just see what happens. Haste, Wapaloozy, Killer Clown, Broom, Funeral Mountain, uh, Terror Shot, Miracle Touch, Scatter Shot, Water Aura. I definitely didn't get a lot of Aura. And Tizarok. So now we have the Reverse Foil and the Foil. In this box, just again, we'll show that again. Tizarok. Not a bad card. Actually, it's a really good card. I'd like to play that card, but... We'll just have to see what I brew up while I'm checking out all this stuff. Alright. So, River Dino. Uh, Rumpafusil. Sam's Four Leaf Clover. Shadow People. Chibi Quetz. Crossroads. Dragon's Breath. Another Plaza Bird. I'll take it. Sure. You can only play one per spell book, but... I didn't get any in my last box, so... Ooh, another Earth Aura. I, don't, I didn't get any Earth Auras, I don't think. I, don't, I didn't get a lot of things, but... Usually you have to open two boxes to get a good smattering of things. I do that for magic, so... It just kind of makes sense. Exploding Mine, Fireball, Gigi Bird, Ghost Deer, 
Ice Storm. I want to just go back to that ghost here because it's so cute. Okay, moving on. Ice Storm, Icy Path, Invisibility, Forced God Zamper. I got four of these. Four. Four. Uh, forest. Well, I definitely don't need any more Forced God Zamper. So that's great. That is, a, that is a good sign. And I could build two forest decks, or I could build a hybrid deck. Killer Clown, Space Penguins, Earthquake, Old Green Eyes, Retribution, Hide Behind, Black Cat, River, Duh -duh. Slide Rock Bolter, oof, oof. Oh my gosh. Reverse holo like my my first one. Uh I want him to be so good. I guess you just have to pump those lightning in the bottles into him and then I don't know. That's the only thing you can do. Even if you did that, could you could they just be no, because then right away they could just say, well, okay. I don't know. I, I'm speculating, that's for another video. Giant Salamander, Old Green Eyes, Sewer Alligator, Water Gun, Morpheus, Menahune, Proton Beam, and an Upside Down Daytime. What's behind door number one? We have another Forest God's Amber. I got five! Five Forest God's Ambers! Did I get five? I think I got five. Five. Oh, wow. 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 Five, guys. Five Force God Ambers. We got two more packs left. Okay, let's see what we get. We ended up getting three of the um, Obnoxious Nine. We didn't, we haven't seen, uh, in total in the two boxes, I haven't seen an Uncle Sam, and I haven't seen a Ghost Train, that's for sure. And I haven't seen that Fire Spell either. Um, so anyway, Dino... Rumpdefusel, Sam's Four Leaf, Shadow People, Balancing Beam, Shock Aura, Stone Skin. We got a Forest, followed by Quetzalcoatlus. Such a beaut. What a crazy good card. Very fast. Um, not a not an obnoxious nine, but an incredibly good pull. I, I I don't mind that at all. My first box, I got two Loveland Frogmans. This box, I got none, but I got a ton, a ton of the crystals. That is so crazy. All right, last pack, guys. Last pack. So we got four leaf clover, shadow people, sliver cat, space penguins, crossroads, dra dragon's breath, Enfield monster, and boom, bat squatch. See, these are common. Oh well. You know, that's how these go. Uh, Water Aura, right there. Let's see. Out of these, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven commons that came in reverse foil, and or commons and uncommons that came in reverse foil that uh, took up the slot of a rare, which is, you know, it is what it is. Um, I think that that's unfortunate, but, you know, can't win them all. Maybe it's a good design uh, choice for them. So we're going to look at this. We got our Power 9 right there. Not Power 9, Obnoxious 9. And then we got a ton, ton, ton of crystals. All right. How many did we pull? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13. So just about a third of the possible rares that we got in this box were crystals, which is great. Again, I'm down for that. I, I needed them anyway. Then we got our Obnoxious 9. This is my second Sam Sinclair, my second growth, and actually my second Death Beam. So the um, Obnoxious 9 that we pulled in here, I also pulled in the other one, but I also got Chessie and a couple others. So we, only, we didn't get as many Obnoxious 9 this time around, which is fine. Um, you know, there's singles out there, and then new cards. I just pulled this is my first Plaza Bird, uh, my first um, 
Fresno Night uh, Nightcrawlers. Yeah, Nightcrawlers. My first Hodag. And that's it. There you go. All right, guys. So that is a second box of MetaZoo Cryptid Nation. Oh, you're not seeing that. MetaZoo Cryptid Nation. Yay! Um, the next batch that we see is going to say first edition, but it's not going to say Kickstarter anymore. So we're just going to have that nice little first edition symbol. And if I remember correctly, based on their announcements, that also um, they're going to have a limited amount of those metal cards. Not metal, M-E-T-A-L, but metal, M-E-D-A-L. Um signifying their uh, first edition release so you'll get a bunch you you get those with uh purchase of metazoo products um so that's pretty cool i can't wait for that that should be sometime this month actually uh coming up pretty soon here i think i think it's in a week um and then yeah i think that's it again i, I really strongly suggest if you want any good information or, or just uh, a really huge community of uh pretty friendly um MetaZoo folks, you should join their Discord. There's a lot of information there and a lot of really great folks. And uh, if you like the video, please, please like and subscribe. I appreciate all of you guys who do so. Um, and again, if you have any comments, leave them below. I, I, I'm definitely up for that as well. Um, and I think that's it. Until next time, guys. Peace.